It is Wednesday, everybody, and we're back to rain here in Ohio, which makes me just want to go back to bed, but I'm not going to get some work done. First thing up on the list today is to cross post some listings I put up uh, early this morning when I couldn't sleep. And then I have several orders to ship. Should be a good day of sales again, thankfully. And then I'm gonna force myself to go to the Goodwill outlet. Like I said, I just feel like staying home, but when you're a reseller, you have to plan ahead. The kids are off school Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, and we have family coming into town. And then remember, I have meetings on Thursday, I wanted to get my nails done, so I'm really home Thursday through Monday. Do I have enough inventory to last that many days? Realistically, no. So I have to get my button gear this morning and head out to the Goodwill outlet, which means later you get a haul. Okay, it's 9.40, I'm dressed, I've got all my shipping done as you guys saw, $146.99 going out today, glad I listed some stuff this morning, and uh, I'm going to stop at a local bakery and get uh, ordered a uh, Easter cookie decorating kit, I thought that would be fun for the kids to do with their grandma this weekend when she comes down for Easter, and then I'm headed shopping trying to get motivated I may pick up either a Red Bull or a coffee at the bakery so hang tight here we go okay made it out alive I spent about an hour and a half in there it's a little after one o'clock I was bad and didn't pack my lunch but I'm craving some McDonald's french fries and a Diet Coke don't judge um, I got five bags of clothing and one purse that should last me till Tuesday when I'm allowed to shop again because I just don't like the idea of taking the kids out. And I want to spend this weekend with family. It'd be kind of rude to leave my kids with my mother-in-law and go to the Goodwill. Although one time my sister-in-law did go with me, so we'll see how it goes. But for now, I'm stocked up. I'm going to get lunch and I'll show you guys what I picked up when I get home. I spent about... $75, $79, something like that. So a pretty big haul. Um, so mine is from ThreadUp. Kids can sign my, I didn't find anything for Play-Dohs, which is fine because I still have a pretty big bag of stuff. And the rest is for me to sell. And I found some, they're more mature brands, but they still sell pretty well. So get done when I need to get done. See you guys when I get home. Okay, what's going on, Ohio? Raining this morning, it is 75 degrees. It is so hot and muggy at home. A little windy sun's out and it's 75 but don't worry I'm sure it'll thunderstorm and then it'll be 55 tomorrow goodness sakes let me unload the truck I'll see you guys in a second alrighty Whew. one two three four five bags of clothes I bought at the Goodwill outlet where you pay by the pound for clothing I buy it cheap and I resell it from one online and that's how I make a living it's a full-time reseller I have the doors open so you'll see my porch swing. It turned a little bit different today so I can have some natural light on the good side. But wait until you see what I picked up. Exciting stuff. Let's get into this. First up is 
Okay, I'm trying this because I saw another reseller. Say what, size 1X. It's kind of this bohemian printed cardigan. Sell myself. Pair of Justice shorts. Kids consignment. Okay, this is just Old Navy, but I loved the eyelet detail. So, yeah, Old Navy, size medium. It's a cute little sundress. I almost saw that myself. Um, Looked down the pockets on these. These are just Faded Glory Kids Consignment. Oop, I have a stain. We'll see. This I thought was great. This is a Tahari dress, size four. Glittery, like this could be good for Mother of the Bride. Let me hold it over here. Like a beige. I don't know, I'm gonna list that myself. We'll see what it goes for. This is Chaps. It's an extra large bohemian cardigan sell it myself another pink Victoria's Secret tank top last one sold overnight sell myself this I was excited to find I haven't found this in a while this is a toad and co dress which used to be that brand horny toad so it's like a Thai geometric print dress sell that myself oh I'm like looking at stuff like, did I pick this up? Okay, a very lightweight, just chain print blouse that's for thread up. Benny has these little lightweight I can put in there. The more money I'll make. And I got my gift cards from the last haul. This is just a Cat and Jack summer top. Ooh, okay, wait. This is also an old navy dress. Also size medium. Should I lock these up? I mean, they're totally different styles. Maybe maybe I could lot them and I'll just put like Old Navy sundress. Lot of two. Size medium. Maybe it'll sell. Okay, this. Okay. I don't need the underwear. Hush. Ah, really? There's nothing. I don't need the underwear attached, but I found more Victoria's Secret. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Come on, thing. This is okay. Victoria's Secret. Hello. Whoa. There we go. And usually, right here, it says the name of it. This is a size medium. It's body by Victoria. And it's like this bralette. I do well with those. Especially on Macari. So if you're not cross posting, have at it. This is so cute. This is Gap Kids Extra Extra Large. And it will you get out of my bags, please? It's a pair of romper overalls. Kids consignment. This is a brand paradise kind of this gauzy material this is new with tags so I'll list that myself okay this I have not picked up this brand in a while but I like that it's floral and summery yada yada it's just this tank Altered state. Okay. Love hate relationship. You tell you what. I hate it so much I'm gonna send it to Plato's. <laughs> okay, then I found some Under Armour shorts. Saw those myself. I found this glittery number by the brand Connected Apparel, size 10. Okay, evening out. And if don't sell them, I'll just send it to throw it up anyways. 
Okay, then we have, oh, this was cool. This is Pink by Victoria's Secret Ultimate. Ultimate unlined size large. Okay, it's a sports bra. There's the logo on the bottom, but I liked the, the cutouts. So, I saw that myself. These are, what are you? Oh, champion, or nine by champion, or whatever, another pair of athletic shorts. Oh, and here's one bag that I picked up. Tutillo, New York. And I looked it up. Pumps were, I like the style of it. Look out, another crossbody bag. Inside looked good. I'll look up comps, and if it doesn't do well, then I'll take it to... I uh, probably closed my place. All right, bag number one is done. Bag number two. Yo, oh, that's got some good stuff in it. Okay, this is a velour top by Loft. You guys know I love sending that to thread up. Hang on, this one's inside out. This is. A mess. Come on. There we go. Maddie M. I don't know. Lightweight boho looking tank top. Throw it up. A Tahari blazer. It's like navy, longer. Throw it up. Let me get like six to eight dollars for those. Okay, what is this? Oh, some 505s, Levi's. They are my husband's size. I figured out why I have so much laundry. Mm -hmm. So my husband, it's all his fault. <laughs> he wears dress clothes to work or his, uh, you know, branded apparel to work for the airline that he works for. He comes home, he changes into jeep fixing clothes, which is usually jeans and a t-shirt. And then he changes into a pair of shorts for bed. So, thanks, honey. That's where all the laundry comes from. Okay. All right. Next I found... Now, these I'll sell myself. These are the 311 Shaping Skinny, size 32. And they're distressed. Raham, or they're supposed to be rolled. And this one's a fit me. I don't know what size I am. Like, I don't know. I'm a cheap person, and I don't buy clothes that are... You know, 20s and 30s. I'm the even number gal. I'm like a 14, okay? All right. This is a splendid top. I liked it because of the ruffle sleeve. I'll sell that myself. Getting into some of the good stuff. Another Lily Pulitzer. Little cardigan. And this bright turquoise color. Hey, that would probably go with that shirt too well, actually. Alright, what else we got in here? Come on. Give me something. Alright, we have a Tahari t-shirt. Right up. A White House Black Market. Remember, this is the new label. When it's all spelled out all the way across, that's what the one's been doing well for me. And sometimes the other one. Oh. Whoops, this is like a tie neck. Has a little rhinestone detail. And let me show you a trick. I get asked, how do you find stock photos? You learn certain brands, okay? This is 100% polyester. So on this tag, for White House Black Market, which is also related to Chico's, the number, yo, yo. Oh my God, come on. It doesn't like my finger. Anyways, it starts with 570 on the tag. If I can get it to work, come on. I don't know, 570, sorry. Not the best camera skills over here, but I'm trying to get information out. So I'll list that myself. I think I might've sold this sweater before. White House Black Market. This is just tan. Yep. 
570-182-149, viscose and nylon. Sell myself. Oh, this is cute. This is a little girl's old navy dress. I found one toward piece this time. I think I cleared them out. So it's like a cold shoulder lace. Mm, towards another one that you can find the stock photo is really easy. It doesn't say uh, style number. It says item number. So if you just go to Google, type toward and the item number, hopefully this will come up. Don't spend too much time on it. If you can't find the stock photo cruising through the first page of the images, just skip it and use a white background. You'll be fine. This brand, I don't know what it is, but I like the boho style of this. It is Emberly. Have you heard of that? Size small. It's either boutique or something. It's like a drop waist little dress. Hundred percent cotton. It is lined, made in India. Okay. Then we have this ribbed top by Sanctuary. You know, just some classic. Hold up. Look at the yellowing on that. Is that yellowed? I think I need to wash that. Hmm. A little bit. I don't know. Maybe thread up. Shh. Okay. <laughs> okay, another girl's little dress. This is a Tommy Hilfiger dress. It's cute. It has a little tie in the front. It's kind of more of a fall, but that's okay. And this is a neutral size zero. We'll see how the smaller size does. White House Black Market Blazer. Next up, yeah, come on. This is cute. This is also just Old Navy, size large, perfect for like a wedding guest, right? I'll well, set myself because it's cute. Who are you? Oh, this is Lane Bryant. This really nice lace pink dress. Lane Bryant, sometimes I can find the stock photos on too. You just gotta try the numbers on the tag and if, like I said, if you can't find it, just skip it. Don't stress yourselves out. This is a little Cat and Jack tutu dress. Girlfriend's texting me. Okay, what the, this is new with tags. It is a new day, which is just Target. Look at the colors on this, right? Putting color in my closet. Tie waist. New with tags. What well, was on clearance? It was $27.99. I don't know, 15 bucks or something. I'm telling you that wind's whipping, and as soon as the kids get off the bus, or right when they pull in, it'll be storming. My girlfriend, she lives about an hour and a half west of us, which is where all the weather comes in. She texts me, it's your meteorologist. It's going to storm. You better hurry up and get home because she gets all the weather first. J. Crew Mercantile, size large, like this mustard cardigan. J. Crew is another one you can find on the tag. Style, yada, yada. Now, as a tip, stock photos do not use stock photos on ebay i use remove.bg if you just go to google okay type it in the web address remove.bg you can upload your photos and it will automatically remove the background for you i save that and i use that for ebay and if i can't find the stock photo for poshmark because i don't want to get my ebay account shut down okay this i was not sure about um very interesting thing uh kinross cashmere size small and it's like a t-shirt and then it has these rappy do i don't know what you're supposed to do with this so hopefully i can find a stock photo uh we'll see but it looked to be in good condition and it's cashmere and it's a bright color okay 
Next is, this is Kids Consignment, another cute little dress, art class, size extra large. Look at how boho and cute. Prairie. They'll love these dresses. This was a cute little spring coat. I might list this myself. Jimbery, I sold one of those dresses for $12 this week. I got at the bins. Look at this cute jacket. I'm going to list that myself. Needs to be seen, but that's okay. A little pair of polo Ralph Lauren. Size medium shorts. I think those are kids or those sleep shorts. I don't know. Oh. We have an Elsa nightgown. No, we don't because it has some holes in it. Trash. Trash. Ooh, this was a good find. I was like, <laughs> super excited. Eileen Fisher in the bins. Look, that's so cute, like for summer. Like a navy tank top on underneath or white. Uh, yeah, list that myself. That was well on eBay. Okay, this is something I need to look up. W-A-Y-F. It's a very pretty, flouncy, feminine top. If it doesn't have good comps, I'll send it to thread up. Same with this. I don't know what this is, but it's very prairie, boho style, ruffly. And it is Oliviacious. I feel like that's like a Nordstrom brand or something. I don't know. Very cute. List myself. See, I'm going to have so much to list. I'm not going to know what to do with myself. Um, I found me a flamingo night shirt to sleep in. Oh. Ah, they have Santa hats. Oh, well. You know what? Who cares? <laughs> my husband don't care. We've been married 12 years. He could care less what I wear, what I wear to bed. Right? Mm, yeah, okay. Uh, Catherine's. I do well with plus size. You guys know. Ah! Who are you? Can you scrape off of here? Ooh. Let's test it out. Yep, it'll come off. Okay. This is pretty. For my sheer. I just like the pattern on that and all the beading around there. Looks good. <laughs> Cat tights. Cat belly, New York. Ooh. I wonder if my friend at the Humane Society, her daughter might be this size. I'll text and ask her. If not, I'll send it to consignment. What is this? Express Portofino shirt. Sometimes pattern of this does well. Since this is just plain, I picked it up for thread up because it literally weighs nothing. Same with this. Lily White. Okay, looks like spring, super light. You know, you can tuck all this in. And how many of these can you fit in a 30 pound box? Quite a bit. This is really cute. I might list this myself. I need to look up comps. Tutu and Lulu. It, I, I thought for sure this was like Matilda Jane. Okay. If it's unique, I'm going to list that myself. Two more bags. Wait a minute, Roxy. Okay, we have this really cute pair of pants for consignment. Told you I love Ann Taylor for thread up. It's just a little skirt. Whoops, a thread on it. A thread on it for thread up. Pair of shorts with flamingos. Hold up. These are seven, eight. Nope, not good though. Okay, I found this lace polka dot bra with underwire. This is Bally size 42C. So my last bra today from the last haul. Okay, this is cool. I don't know if it's vintage or not, but it is a men's extra large and my husband is obsessed with this place. So babe, if you wanna wear it, how about it? It's like a raglan tee, is that what that's called? No, it's double stitch. Okay, well, husband can have that and a new pair of jeans. He tries to convince me all the time that we need to move to Alaska, but I can't just leave my family here, so. 
and then him and my daughter plan to move to Montana so she can go to vet school and then um, they're just gonna leave me in the dust and my daughter says she's getting like five huskies and her and daddy are gonna live there. <laughs> Big plans guys. The Nike T size extra large. This is kids extra large. There's no way this is an extra large because that's what I wear and like it doesn't even cover one boob. So kids can sign in on that. Look at this. Sophie Rose. 3T. Oh, okay. Consignment. Don't know. Consignment. I'm not. I'm going to cruise through this kid's stuff. Okay. I don't know what this is, but Sky and Sparrow. Size large. Okay. This is a little eyelet. Something or other for little girlies on Depop. I can still wear that stuff. Actually, you know what? I never wore that stuff. Who am I kidding? All right, a little pair of pants. Stretch legging. A little athletic pair of shorts. <laughs> Look at that design. That's cute. Another pair of unique kids' jeans. I like the jeans. Okay, this is for thread up. It's Anna. Look how light. <laughs> Squeeze them all in. Squeeze as many as possible. Okay, this is a little girl's dress by Rare Editions. You know, and even though Easter is going to be done this weekend, there's still weddings to go to, there's still summer picnics, family reunions birthday parties like other reasons for girls to dress up these i'm pumped about now they are not the leather leggings that i've sold before in 15 minutes for 56 bucks but i found a pair of spanx white denim raw ham pants definitely selling those myself i don't understand how people miss all of this like i said they must just be looking for different than me athletic it's consignment. Justice shorts. Hmm. They look a little too short for Annabelle. She's shaped a little different than her mommy. This is a US medium Adidas sweatshirt. I use that myself unless Annabelle tries to steal it. J. Crew the Sutton 3230. I think these are men's. I liked how they had the name. They were good condition. Okay. This Heart Moon Star. I don't know. Oh, it's just Charlotte Ruse. Well, you know what? It's still cool. Bustier, cheetah print. Okay. Saw that myself. Kids jeans. Looking at the pocket detail. Pair of Nike dry fit shorts, size small. 12 to 15 all day long on those guys. Wouldn't pay up for them. Get them at the bins. Okay, this pair of what are these? I thought they were Carters. Very cute little summer tights, leggings. All right. Oh, I thought that was Thunder for a minute. Nope. I picked up this Morgan and Co. size eight gown. Okay. Why? Because. Prom season is a coming. White and gold. Okay. I'll have to put this. This is one. Well, I will take my time and put it on a mannequin. There was a video out yesterday um, by Kaylee Elaine and her girls talking about how to save time. I quit using a mannequin, guys. It cost me $50 for that mannequin. It takes so much time to put stuff on, off, on, off, turn, twist, take the pictures, forget it. 
The only time I do is if it's a long dress like that or like yesterday I had that Lily Pulitzer dress that was strapless. How am I supposed to put that on a hanger and it look good? So I do use the mannequin occasionally. It's nice to have her here. All right, last in this bag is another brassiere. Another Bally. Just white, classic. There's the back. Bigger size bras do well. 42 double D. So, yep. Even these, I just put it on a hanger, slap it on the wall, remove.bg. Not .com, just remove.bg. I can't repeat that enough. That is what I use to get my main photos to have the white background every time. eBay likes white backgrounds. I've heard that makes your listings pop up more in Google search. What's that called? SEO? Yeah, search engine optimization. <laughs> hey, another acronym I should have had in my video yesterday. All right, last bag, and then I'm gonna try to get some pictures done. Before it gets too dark, as you see, I have a big bay window here, so thankfully I don't have to have a light kit. I try to work before the kids get off the bus, if not a little bit after. I go lay down for a little bit, take some pictures, make dinner. We're having barbecue pork sliders tonight with Kobe Jack cheese, some red onion. Shh, I'm gonna sneak it in there and like half of them. Some corn on the cob and a salad. I would have loved to have french fries, but we're trying to get healthy around here. Hubby went to the cardiologist yesterday for his yearly checkup. If you didn't know this time last year, uh, he had some very bad blood pressure problems for only being 36. And all was well, except they said we're still fat. <laughs> so we need to start losing some weight, which we will, slowly but surely, you know. And I'll be honest, today was the first time I had McDonald's for lunch in, geez, three weeks, a month. It did not taste that great. Like, why was I, ugh, no, I will not be going back. All right, next up is this little girl's dress. Very cute. You know, it's hard to find these at reasonable prices. This is Zenzi Extra Large. I don't know, kids can sign it. Boop, over there. Okay, then I found this Jennifer Lopez Brighton, hello, size large, sold at Kohl's, retailed for $54. Here we go. So, I don't know, it was new with tags, so I decided to pick it up. Okay, ooh, then this is really cool. I think this will do well on Depop. It looks vintage, extra, extra large. It's like, what is this, a bomber jacket? What are these called? Track jacket? I don't know. Red, white, and blue. Extra, extra large. So, I have lots of lists this time. Okay, we have another little dress. I miss when my daughter was a girly girl. That is long gone. Okay, we got some floral whatnots. We have another little girl's dress. Very cute. We have a kid's camo under armor sweatshirt. What size are you? That's a youth large. I'm gonna have to, wait, is that a stain or is that part of the? I'm going to put it in the consignment because my kids are kind of in between those sizes. I thought maybe they could wear it, but no. Um, this was good. Maybe I'll sell this one myself. It's a kid's lightweight jacket. For, I'm thinking spring, right? And it's by London Fog. Zipper works good. Size medium, which is 10-12. So, yeah, I probably list that myself. Whoa, there goes the pile. Okay. We have Ann Taylor pants. These go to thread up every single time. Whoa, -ho -ho, another Eileen Fisher. It does have some damage on it, not gonna lie, but how can you leave Eileen Fisher at the bits? You can't. List it myself and I'm just gonna disclose it has a couple holes in it. Deal with it. <laughs> 
I mean, I'm going to adjust the price. Okay. Champion. Another favorite pair of green. These are an extra large. Yeah, I'll try these on. Why? Because they're my favorite color. We're going to paint our Jeep this color, too. Wait till I show you guys that one. My hubby's done with it. He's been working on it for almost a year and a half. Took the body off of it and everything. He's repainting it. He's redoing it. He's welded so much, like holes in the frame. It's a stick shift, though. And if you have me on Facebook, you understand my anxiety is going to get the best of me because I'm sure I'm going to stall it out in the middle of the town. Everyone's going to beep at me, look at me. It'll be okay. But yeah, that's the color we're going to paint our Jeep with like matte black for the trim. It's a 1991. I had to get this straight because I don't know nothing about cars. A 1991 YJ Wrangler, Jeep Wrangler. Okay, cool. Um, another Soma bra. This sold super quick, less than a week. Actually, is this the same one? This one's an extra large. I think the other one was a large. Sold on Mercari for like 19 bucks in a week. Pick up bras at the outlet, pick up bras at the outlet, pick up bras at the outlet. They all sell. A little pair of shorts. Look at this dress. This is cute. Who are you? Oh, it's just H&M, but it's cute. If you have young kids, go to the bins for yourself sometime. Another cat and Jack. Oh, is that backwards? No. A little tutu rainbow dress. I'm looking at stuff like, what is this? This is Darissa. More modern tag. I do have some vintage size 12. Kids' pants or capris, whatever. Children's place. Hey, I should have enough to fill a bag you now. This is just an Old Navy extra large top. I'm telling you. Put it up for 10 bucks on like Facebook Marketplace. Extra large and up. They will sell. Anything that looks like Bohemian like that too. Okay, then we have... I saw this. And this is Pink Active. And it's like a running jacket. Purple. with them holes. <laughs> List myself. And lastly, what is this? Just another Elsa kids shirt. Disney ties in the front. So, whew, I'm tired. That's everything I got at the Goodwill bins today. Please make sure to subscribe to my channel as I try to post videos every single day with tips, tricks, and other info about what I'm doing, selling full-time online as a reseller of clothing, shoes, more, and whatever I can get my hands on to make a profit, make a living, and take care of my bills. <laughs> See you guys in the next one.